using grids. A grid is an invisible set of rows and columns that helps to organize a page. Figma has several different types of grids that can help you. Let's give it a try. I'm going to create a new frame from a preset. Under Phone, I'm going to select iPhone 11 Pro Max. In the design palette on the right side of the screen, I'm going to find layout grid. And I'm going to select the plus. The default grid is 10 pixels by 10 pixels. Select the small grid icon to open the menu. Change the size from 10 to 69. Hit enter on your keyboard. Notice how the small grid now becomes a bigger and easier to see grid. I will now create a new frame. Select preset iPhone 11 Pro Max X and do the exact same thing, except this time under layout grid, instead of selecting grid, I will select columns. I will change the count from five to seven and hit enter. Notice how the thick columns have become thinner. And finally, I will make one last frame using Android as my preset. Select Layout Grid. Change that from grid to rows. Change the count from five to 10. And this time I will change the type from stretch to center. Notice how the thick rows become thinner and notice how the rows that were all stretched out from top to bottom have now clustered into the middle, leaving no rows showing on the top and bottom of the frame. Notice that the layout grid has the same four dots like we had in the fill menu. You can create a style for a specific grid and reuse it per frame. So here, if I select Android One's grid, create a style and call it Android, create style. I could go and create a new frame, select the layout grid and create that exact same layout. This time, I'd like you to try something different. Make sure that you can see all three of the frames that you created, iPhone 11 Pro Max, iPhone 11 Pro, and Android. Because grids are invisible when you export, I cannot see them, so therefore I need you to take a screenshot. Using a Mac, select Command, Shift, and the number four, Click and hold and drag over the three frames and let go. This has created a screenshot. That screenshot shall now be saved as last name project 02A09.